Hi everyone, how are we doing? It's been a while since I've been online. So uh, those that have stood by me and uh, supported us, thanks very much for all the, the kind messages. Um, just stuff going on, you don't want to know. <laughs> but it's been, uh, it's good to come back. I've, uh, I've definitely missed it. Been wondering what to play. Uh, I know I usually go on Euro Truck Simulator. American Truck Simulator, stuff like that. Uh, I thought I'd stick with um, iRacing. I've been putting quite a bit of time in on this at the moment. So I thought I'd give this a thrash. Um, tonight we're going to be on Charlotte Motor Speedway. Uh, Gaming 101. Hello, Mace. Good to see you, fella. Long time no see. So yeah, we've got a Charlotte Motor Speedway. We've got a race on at 8 o'clock. So I'm going to do some... Practice laps, then do some qualifying, and then we're going to see where we're going to get. Um, I did a race actually. I think it was, uh, I think it was last week when I was just having some quiet time. Uh, qualified first, came second. <laughs> I was really, really chuffed with that. So I'm definitely improving. I'm no super racer, by the way. <laughs> I just, I just get in and drive them. Uh, it's probably luck half the time. So we're going to get on with it. We're going to do some practice laps, like I say, around um, around the speedway. Here we go. This is my Mazda MX-5. Little beast. Uh, eventually, as we're going around, people will come on the track. This is live. Um, this is live, obviously, on YouTube and also on iRacing. So I'm going to give it a start and see where we're going to go. I'm going to do some slow laps to start with just to get a feel of it. you got to get the toys nice and warm as well. So I did really well on this um, last week. So I do know some of the corners Some of the guys who are on this game is really, really quick. So this is just my outlap. Gives you guys an idea of the corners where they're at, and then we'll just build on it. This is great, this part, because it goes on a bit of a bank, and it's flat out. Racing this uh, a few days ago, I was going 123 round this bend. If you start streamlining the guys that are in front here, like really catapults you down here. So coming down to the start line now, I'm trying to remember where to break. flat round here. Bottom left hand side you'll see my steering wheel inputs, my accelerator, my brake inputs as well. Accelerator's in green. That was a rubbish corner. That's just while I'm demonstrating. So in red is the brake. I can't remember the times I was getting, I think 124s, 125s. Let's see what I can get. Ah. Hey up, Mace, how we doing? Mr. Deep, how we doing, fella? So, sorry I've not been on lately, just uh, a lot going on at the minute, so I needed a breather. Well, we'll do a proper laugh after. Pop a lap after this one. So I can normally get 120 odd around here. It might be my fuel level, mind I'm quite full of fuel. Quite high 
hard into it. Fourth, third. Flat out. You'll see on the bottom left. Break. Fourth. Third. You have to watch this one because it's so easy to drift a bit too wide. Oh, Simon. Track limits. Come on. This lap will be deleted. Yep, so that's my crew chief. Tells me when I'm right and when I'm wrong. He does swear at you as well. <laughs> I have to really annoy him to get him to swear. So that's flat. Fourth. So we should get that good target speed now. We're in a semi automatic gearbox here as well, so no gear change uh, from the stick. Still a bit low on speed. I think it's definitely going to be the fuel level. Uh, race is 8 o'clock, guys, so hopefully stick around. Flat, fourth, still flat. You can spin it there if you're not the right. Got it totally wrong set up. Oh, that's not right either. Joys of practice laps. I found slower the better on that corner. And it's set up for this one. If you go too hot into this, you end up on the grass, into the fence. did happen to me. Try and rev it high. Sector two time is good. It's good. Time was 126.80. So now I can shave off a bit of time on that. This corner is the bane of my life. So easy to get that wrong. Uh, 125.84. Sector 3 time is quick. That'll do. Drift it out a bit further. The apex pull out. Still feels slow. Okay. 
never had a 1x there. Uh, 1x is if it's telling you that you're well beyond the track limits. I'd like to know where on that corner your track limit is. quicker felt bit pants Oh no, Simon, you've cut the track. They'll delete the lap. Damn. See, you know, you can lose grip so easily on that corner. spinning out. Ooh, bit twitchy on the bum. I don't know if you can tell from the screen, but... I definitely know when I'm losing grip. Does help having a force feedback wheel just just starts to go loose. Gives you that feeling of oh, you've lost some grip, Simon. <laughs> Stopping a bad boy. Sector one's quick. Didn't feel it. That's what she said. Was that 126.03? You're uh, currently 0.6 off your best. I see where we're at. Sector 2 is 0.7, slower than your best. I see where we're at. Meant to be really racing, in all honesty. So I'm just going to uh, do some checks, see where we're at. Should really be racing. Uh, race now. There, test car and track. I don't think I clicked on the right button, Simon. Oh, 
Right, so we'll just let that load up. It's just preparing the session. We're going to join the practice now. Hopefully that will load up on the screen in a second. Yeah, so sorry I've not been around, guys. It's like I say, stuff's been going on uh, behind the scenes. But I've been working on the website. The website's coming on really well. And uh, working on the social media, so Twitter and Instagram. Um, you can find me all over the place, if I'm honest. <laughs> Over to the screen will come up. There we go. Uh, I'll be streaming through the rest of the week as well. Tomorrow will probably be Euro Truck Simulator. Uh, Thursday, Wednesday and Thursday as well, I think. It should be good. Watch uh, options, graphics. All right, frame rate's a little bit low, so hopefully it won't be too choppy for you guys on the screen. Right, so this is the proper practice now, so we'll we're playing with other people on the track. Looks like you're clear on the pit exit. Race, uh, racing starts about eight o'clock, so we'll do some more. The track temps increasing. It's now 45 Celsius. So we'll do some more thrashing around. Outlap, so if you're just coming in, don't worry, I don't normally drive this like this. I was watching Jimmy Broadbent as, uh, on Saturday and Sunday while he was doing their Daytona 24 hour. That was I racing as well, did some really good racing. Shame it's the server went down when he was doing that. See if that's better. Feels a bit lucky to me. Turn a lot of the uh, settings down as well. Well, because I'm streaming as well, though. Wow, there's a lot of people registering in this race. Uh, not concentrating, Simon. Thank you, thank you. Oh no, I just can't hear you. Ah, oh, 
Track limits, come on. This lap will be deleted. Simon. <laughs> so just as well. Wow, someone's done it to one a 122.6 round here. Guy behind me, he's just spun out. There's some quick guys on the track if you look at the standings, bottom right hand side. Oh, this lap's going to be absolutely rubbish because of my sector. Fastest lap for Wilson or twenty two point nine three. At least I didn't die then. Ah, it's gone a bit wide. Sector one is not point eight off the pace. <laughs> Thanks for telling me that. It's quite <laughs> it kills you when you're like, oh, how much off the pace? Sector two is zero point four five off the pace. Well, that's not too bad. We're coming down. That Lynn Wilson. Wow. Lap in the session. That's the best lap ever, 124.0. Not a patch on the other guys. That's a new fastest lap for Wilson, 122.39. Wow. I better be careful because they'll be right on my arse in a minute. Oh. Simon, come on man, watch them track limits. This lap won't count. Of course, you'll have to slow down and give up the time gained. Do me oil rating very well, but keep coming off. Doing third though, so um, in the practice anyway. Fastest lap for Wilson, 122.22. Slidey. <laughs> I'll just drift it round. Oh. <laughs> no, that ain't going to get me any lap times. <laughs> I thought I could drift it round there then. 
Though this isn't Drift Simulator. <laughs> oh my. That's a new fastest lap That's just pushed me down to 6 Hey, Hello Sim Gamer, how we doing mate? Good to see you fella. That lap was shocking. No drifting allowed, Simon. I think I'm playing cautious now. Oh, Simon, you... Back end's really tail happy all of a sudden. Sector 1 is 2.3 seconds, off the pace. Seventh now. I think I'll find if I'm too far down the pack, I'm just going to play dead safe in this race. Sector 2 is 1.3 seconds off the pace. You're now 3.5 seconds off the leader's pace. Sector 3 times OK. So it gives me some uh, some kind of target. Sector one is 1.4 seconds off the pace, which isn't too bad considering what they're doing at the minute. They're doing 1 minute 22, so that's not bad. Considering I was doing 125s. Jack Thomas, hello mate. How are we doing fella? Long time no see. So I've had some time off just uh, get my head together. Just done at 124.25. That's good for me. So it should be nearly time for qualifying, I think. So we'll just get back to the pits. Still put me seventh though. On a 124.0. Wow, 121.9. to a stop, I think. Sector 2 is 2.3 seconds off the pace. The track temperature is falling. It's now 43 Celsius. Right. I'm right, thanks, Jack. It's uh, it's good to be back playing again, mate. Uh, I've needed a rest, mate. I was doing quite a lot, wasn't I? So, uh, yeah, had a bit of a break. Uh, be doing Euro Truck Simulator tomorrow, I think. 
Yeah, it's good to be back. So we've done quite a few laps there, practice. Uh, been on since half half seven. Got quite a few laps in. Um, I haven't raced this for about a week. So I'm a little bit rusty on some of the corners, but I'm learning. I'm getting there. So it does normally go into a practice session, then qualifying session. I'll probably not bother doing the um, the practice session, in all honesty. So we'll just watch someone else go round <laughs> for now. There's not many people on the track at the moment. Whoa, he went wide. Who's that? Callum Russell. Don't know if he made a genuine mistake though, if that's just how he drives. The track temperature is increasing. It's now 45 Celsius. Oh, hi Nabis. Hello, mate. Thanks for the welcome back. Good to see you, fella. It's been a long time. Just get me a. Uh, Get my head together. I've had a stressful few weeks, so I needed a break. So what a better thing to do is go all out <laughs> and play oil racing. Oh. So when I did this last week on my own, my beats per minute was 165. Looks like everyone struggles that corner. Where's he going? Oh, okay. <laughs> right, so let's do our qualifying sesh. What have you been up to, Nabist? You been uh, up to anything? You been uh, you been good, lad? All clear on pit exit. You can push now. Okay, Simon. We've got two laps to get the job done. So now we're going to do our two qualifying laps, and then it will pick the best out of the two. And we're all off track on that corner. I hate that corner. So this is just the out lap. Try and smash two good laps. Get ourselves on the grid. Right, here we go. Ooh. Not like that, though. Well, have you, mate? I've really had to take a massive step back from all this. Um, I guess I've been a bit lost my confidence and I'm a bit anxious with things. Save. Just 
try and keep it smooth. I have no idea how we're going to end up on this. So someone smashing in 123s. Uh, Aaron Peacock and Matthew Grant. Norbert's in there with a 124. Sixth place. Aha. Uh -huh. Didn't roll into that corner like I'd hoped. Did a 124.6 though. Considering how rubbish I took that one corner. skidded out slightly oh and again that's rubbish that's a right off lap so it's a 126 I think 124.6 Charlie's 122.6 I think I've got a really strong grid here so I think my strategy for this race is to keep it on the track, don't hit anyone. The leader has just done a 123.00. E9, that puts you 3.4 seconds off the pace. That's fine. That's fine, I don't mind that. <laughs> Oh, so yeah, that's the plan on this one, I think. Is plate safe? Don't get punted off. Don't punt anyone else off. Um, and keep out of everyone's way, I think, on this one. Get some laps in. I don't really bother with my setups either, because I, I wouldn't know what to change. And this track changes tomorrow, anyway. So... Yeah, it's going to be a tricky one. So we've got about two minutes here. If you got anyone got anything to say, please give me a shout. We've got two minutes to kill. So this is going to be 10 laps of Charlotte Motor Speedway. You can see the track layout top right hand side. It's not a bad track actually. It's very, very similar to the Daytona, I think. It's just a bit odd for a low powered car. <laughs> I do wonder what it's like, what it would be like in a high powered car. The plan with iRacing at the minute is that I think I'm going to carry on with it. My free trial ends in uh, February, so not that far away. Um, I think I'm going to carry on with it. Then it's going to get down the road of buying cars with real money and tracks and the like. Um, I don't know whether I'm at that level yet, but I think the game, it kind of works on your own experience anyway, so it puts people in with your own experience. 
But saying that, I've got people here doing two or three seconds a lap quicker than me, so I'm not sure how that works. Get some biggish jobs than we, mate. Oh, pesky weather. It's cold for us here at the minute. It's minus three this morning. I'm not going to say it's too cold for snow, because that's stupid. <laughs> That's the end of the session. P9. P9. I don't even know how many are actually playing. Ten. <laughs> oh no, no. Um, Twelve. Some people couldn't be bothered to uh, to try. Map completion. How f how far away are you completing it now? I'm looking forward to giving it a play tomorrow. Now I'm sure that guy on the right, he was a bit dodgy, so I need to be careful of him. But still, he still ended up quicker than me, so maybe he just had an off. So we're just waiting for the uh, green start. Ten laps. Right, ready, guys. Okay, Simon, get ready. Floor it, green, green, green. Don't know why I chose second gear there. This is where my heart starts pounding. <laughs> Half a metre of snow. Minus 20. And as me complaining about minus 3. <laughs> no way. Gap to Rivera behind is increasing. It's now 1.0 seconds. Went a bit hot into that. The actor Russell ahead is now not the date. This lot went dead slow then. Pedro was dead close behind there. Let's try and stream this guy. Oh, we'll definitely get a pick up off someone. 125 around this corner. I got a feeling I'm going to get caught up with this lot. Done at 124.18. Okay, 
Okay, Simon, the next car is Soto. I said I wouldn't get in trouble. I get a feeling I'm going to get caught up with these. What are you doing, man? Car right. Hold your line. Hold your line. Hold your line. Still there. Hold your line. Play right. The track temperature's decreasing. It's now 43 Celsius. I knew I was going to get caught with these. On your right. Play right. Come on, Soy. Come on, Soy. Hey, up, Dave. Cam, how you doing, man? <laughs> you in that phone? <laughs> That'll do, that'll do, that'll do, that'll do. I know that guy is pretty close to me behind as well, and I've took that well too wide. Damn, damn, damn. Where's this guy going? Rest up. Car left. Still there. Clear left. Come on, Sino. Keep pushing. We might get him back. There's another guy who's going to get me in trouble. It's like seeing an old friend. <laughs> Fuel P8, you've just done a 125.35. I don't know which truck I prefer, the one from last week or this one. Flag. I think it all depends on who's actually on the track with you as well. Because there's right, some right wombles at the minute. Oh, mate. I was 
Let's try and get this guy back again. Yeah, I like this track. It, it's alright. It reminds me a little bit of Daytona. Track temperatures rising. It's now 43 Celsius. Push now. The guy behind is catching. The leader's just done a 22.93. The car in front has just done a 123.28. No spinny, please, Simon. No spinny. Yeah, that would be cool, Dave. I have no idea how you would do that, but that would be really cool. Considering how experienced you are, to me. Ooh, I didn't even know this had six gears. What? Um, <laughs> yeah, I'm so inexperienced, mate, so that would be awesome to do that, fella. The guy ahead's last lap time is a 22.78. Oh, I was hoping he was going to hit the wall, then. Is that bad? <laughs> that I think that. <laughs> come on, come on, come on. not getting away. I must be doing something right. My heart's pounding. <laughs> I need to breathe. Oh jeez. They can all crash and burn for me. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> right. No sixth gear Simon. We don't need that today. Come on, side, come on. Thanks, man. I, I have. Um, I like to hope I do something, right? What? I just did a 122.7? Knee way. So I think my best has always been a 124. Oh wow, thanks Dave, thanks for that man. Some uh, encouragement there. Come on guys, Simon's here. Things to do, people to see. be intrigued to see my heart rate. In fact, yes, 142. <laughs> Apparently, Ayrton Senna could always do 89 or something. I'm doing 142. The car in front of us is Russell, the gap to Rivera. Behind is now 8.5 seconds. The track temperature is falling. It's now 41 Celsius. Right, these guys can crash and burn, as Dave would say. Slap. Move out the way. Oh. 
Yeah, I need him to just go away. Right, foot down, foot down, foot down, come on. Nah, not the right line, not the right line. Still, I've got sixth place. Um, I think I started ninth. This guy's on the old block. Oh. B6. Okay, it's over. Oh, jeez. That was mental. Great job. You did really well. That was crazy. <laughs> oh, jeez. Stay there, perfect. Yeah, that was alright, that was. Oof. Good job. Thanks, Dave. That was really good. That was nice, kind words from a legend. <laughs> Knows what he's doing. Jeez, honestly, my heart rate. I, I can't even show you on my watch. In fact, I might be able to show you on my watch. I need to learn how to breathe when I'm doing this. I see, my hands are shaking. No, I don't think you're going to see. <laughs> I don't know, I don't think you're going to see. It gets a bit scary. It's quite high. Oh wow, that was that was fun. Ah, oh, thanks for that, man. That's really good. Do you want to quit? Yes, I have to. Yes. Let's see how we did. I mean, I I started off ninth. Um. Exciting. <laughs> oh, last session. I don't know if this is going to see my uh, sessions. Is it going to show? No, I don't think it's going to show. No, it's not showing anything yet. Now, thing is, do I register for the nine o'clock race as well? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Don't know. Don't know. I don't think it's registered the race yet. Just staying in touch and doing the business on the oval. Normally, a procession for about nine laps. Yeah, I, I found it's you just constantly. It's it's a hard one. You you're relying on people really making mistakes, aren't you? My series, my account, my profile. Keep up momentum. I do. It it's. I don't know what's wrong with me. I get really anxious and nervous, and I don't know why. I just I don't know. Am I putting too much pressure on myself or what? I don't know. I really don't know. That hasn't registered the race yet. Yeah, what are you driving at the minute, Dave? Are you um, still doing your... Is it GT4, was it? I'm not sure. Those two rights through the infield, wide entry and cut them slightly. Yeah, I'm fine. You, if you go too fast, you just you're just kind of scrubbing all your speed off, aren't you? Ah, there we go. It's registered the results now. Uh, Simon. Practice. Uh, 
Uh, got an extra 0 0.07 qualifying. 0 0.07. Simon Watton. I rating has gone up 8 points. And 0 0.07 on there. Cool. GT3, I drive, whatever comes up. If someone's trying to talk me into doing the Ferrari challenge. They've been watching my driving and they reckon I should go into the Ferraris, but I'll be honest, I'm not a Ferrari man. I'm more into like the McLarens and uh, maybe not the Merc. Probably because I used to work for them. <laughs> um, but yeah, I've quite, I got a soft spot for the McLaren, so I don't know whether I'm even at a level yet to start doing that. Uh, class D 2.94 at the moment. I don't even. I, I don't want to. I don't want to be too cocky. That's just me. I'm just too much of a plonker. <laughs> right. We're going to do the nine o'clock one. We'll do some more. We'll do some more whizzing round. See if I can do them two rights wide. <laughs> See what heart rate I can get now. I do prefer the GT3 racing. I'd love to go to Spa actually this year. In fact, no, I might make it next year after the wedding. Um, saving up quite a lot for the wedding this year. Uh, that wedding's 27th of December, so once that's out of the way. Um, in the, I'll say that in the most... Uh, most polite for way. <laughs> uh, well, yeah, once that's done. Uh, I could put a bit more money into doing things I really want to do. Right, let's wait for this Henry guy to get past. Yeah, Master's all right. The track temperature's rising. It's now 44 Celsius. See ya, he's off. Yeah, it, it's... For me, I've been trying to follow guys. So I'll sometimes look back at the laps people are doing. Why do I keep going sixth? I look at the fast people and look at how they take the corners. But I'm no expert. I just watch everyone else and then see how fast I can go.
might be taking it too tight there. I probably could do with drifting up slightly a bit more around the bowl. That felt like a good shift. I keep forgetting. <laughs> it's like, ah! Just done it, 122.60. P2. You're two tenths off the pace uh. in sector three. Broke it. Did that sound brummy? I broke it. Off key! <laughs> what am I watching? I know you're not an Oi Racing fan. <laughs> well, my steering's not off. It does feel a bit skittish. Don't put a dislike down off key. Please don't. <laughs> yeah, I've lost my speed, so I'm going to come in. The guy in front has just done a 124.30. Look out for the pit speed limit. Oh, I can't believe I've come off. Well, I can't actually believe. <laughs> Magnetic fence. I hit that fence um, the other day actually, and I think I actually got stuck in it. Proper wedged. The leader has just done a 22.09. Shame I can't pick a quick repair. It's alright, it's fine. Catch up on me chat. Stay as low as you can all over the line. I think I need to watch you, mate, and get an idea of your your um. Oh, yeah, I need to watch you, mate. I think. I might as well wait for the repairs to be done. The guy in front has just done a one twenty three point one two. I'll do a new car. Sometimes, ah, here we go. It is a strange thing to be listening to while doing a modest run between Newcastle and Carlisle. <laughs> How do you know that? I'm not going to ask, actually. Watch who's coming through here. There's quite a few people actually running around. Pit exit's clear. Whoa, someone's just rolled on the corner on the... Oh, Simon, what should you drive and not other people's crashes? 
I just watched someone roll on the uh, on the bank. I like Carlisle, it's nice. Just a shame it's so far away from Newcastle. Well, depends what you're driving. Pants. Do you know actually Nabist? I thought you actually meant for real, then realised you're playing Euro Truck Simulator. <laughs> Sector 2 is 0.6 off the pace. Ooh, ooh I like old videos. Zero off the pace. That lap was at 124.04. Well, I know I could do 122s, but I had a draft and someone to follow. Yeah, yeah, definitely post it. Yeah, I don't know how I got that 122. I think I must have been drafting someone. Or that guy in front. Pace. That was a uh, 123.49. Sector 3 time is fast. No, 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 no. Damn. A bit too much speed into that. I'm getting a bit cocky. Cheers Dave, I'll, uh, I'll, I'll unlock that in a moment. Sector 2 is 0.5 off the pace. Right, this lap's going to be a bit pants. Oh. 
Sector three time is quick. That was better. Sector 1 is 1.5 off the pace. That felt okay as well. See what this spits out. Actually, if off keys there, could you uh, release that message, mate, for me, please? That Dave's posted. Quicker than that. Then you know, I had that cart to start, didn't I? Thank you. Off key, I've missed you, mate. I've missed you. E5. Felt a bit messy. Like I was scrubbing time away. That's alright, mate. No worries. Thank you. It's now 42 Celsius. You've got a slow car on the left. You're now 1.7 off the pace. 123.8. I'm getting quicker slowly. Is that like a... That doesn't even make sense, does it? I'm getting quicker slowly. <laughs> What a plonk now I am. <laughs> uh, I'll have Dave Sugar. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. Oh. No, no, ah. Simon, that was feeling really good. Keep it between the white lines. This lap's been invalidated. Yeah, thanks for that, mate. Yeah, I know. Tell me something I don't know. Oh no, if I could just remember. I get too carried away. What time is it? 10 to 9. Oh, do they go off? That would explain why they go super slidey. Got a slow car on the left. The 
guy behind has just done a 123.62. hug the white line. Wow, okay, well that's half a second I can find. Uh, just saying. <laughs> Ouch. Yeah, thanks Dave. I think I'm, I'm picking it up. I should remember them two rights. And I think, actually, no. Hook it like you mean it. Oh, right, sorry. <laughs> I thought you said don't hug it. And not hugging that white line all the way around. Ah, right, okay, not hugging it could cost you. Got you, got you, got you. No mittens. I haven't got my mittens on, no, and my hands are actually hurting from my fibro. Um, but I had to have... I, I was really missing coming online and seeing you guys. Um, yeah. I really enjoy doing this guys, so I just need to get over my fear of I don't know. I don't know what the fear is. I think it's just me being stupid. <laughs> They're actually my go-kart gloves. When I'm go-karting. Obviously. Yeah, so I was going to look at... Um, it never goes away, does it not, Dave? I, it's... Oh, it freaks me out. It really does. And that's why my heart rate's so stupid. Oh, he's just punted it. Well done, Eric. We were watching you, mate. Maybe it was the pressure of watching him. Uh, yeah, still 143. That's good. <laughs> I get really anxious. The anxiety is crazy. Right, week 13, Madness. Google Mazda at Charlotte Short, 10 minute races. The track temps increasing, it's now 44 Celsius. So I'm just, I've just clicked on the link that Dave sent me. The guy ahead has just done a 123.28. Dave, that link you sent me, is that for the uh, Road Atlanta?
Oh god, off key. Cheers for that uh, thought. You normally tell um, oddball stuff like that. I didn't know I was into that league yet. <laughs> The track temperature is decreasing. It's now 42 Celsius. Uh, some reason it's loaded up uh, Road Atlanta. I'll try it again. Let's try it again. It might be my uh, it might be my computer. No, it's just loaded up your all your uploads, uh, Dave. Um. Oh, Charlotte. Charlotte Roble for a BRS. Is it the Charlotte um, overlay hype, Dave? Come on. Get over there. There we go. Pre raised nerves. Yeah, thanks for that, dude. <laughs> oh, this is a different Charlotte. Is it? Oh yeah, this looks like a different one. It was me and my donut. <laughs> oh, don't talk about donuts. I'm starving. Aha, I've got it now, Dave. Thanks, mate. Mmm, <laughs> donuts. <laughs> Alright, Dave. Yeah, man. Good to... Uh, thanks for coming on, buddy. Cheers, mate. Thank you. I'll let you know how we get on. This will be my last race tonight anyway, I think. But thanks for all your help, man. I'll watch your video quickly and see if I can get some tips. On your lines. Cheers, Dave. Thank you. The track temperature is decreasing. It's now 39 Celsius. Right, so we've got to get onto race mode while I'm watching Dave's video <laughs> on racing lines. I better do uh, the race for me. So how you doing, Offkey? What have you been up to, mate? You sorted your um, Twitter out yet? Let's wait for it to load up.
Yeah, I thought you said you were sorting your Twitter account out. <laughs> Did you just crash? Do you know, actually, I'm not going to bother with any practice. I think I've just done loads of practice there. I'll come back to that. Yeah, I'm sure you said you were sorting out your Twitter account. is increasing. It's now 45 Celsius. Watching any other guys are taking the corners. Oh, yeah, I know that feels off key. That's where I've been for the last two weeks. It's, um, yeah, it's not nice. I can't get out of. Oh, yeah, I can. <laughs> That's how you do it. Oh yeah, qualify. Duh. It takes it looks clear. We've got two laps to set a decent time. Yeah, it definitely helps to qualify, Simon. Right, here we go. See if I've learned anything. Okay. Yeah, it's not a good time to get any slowdown.
P6. I'm 24 dead. I know I can do better than that. Have I done enough? The leader has just done a 122, 127. I might have gone a bit too slow on that inner section. Fastest lap for Martins, 122, 114. I knew I was a bit too slow. A bit too slow on that, on the infield. P6 is okay. Some people haven't qualified yet, so... We'll see what happens. P6 will be uh, pretty canny though. Well, I hope you're okay off, Keith. If there's anything uh, I can do, mate, give me a shout, yeah? If anyone uh, follows Dave Cam, uh, he's a good guy. Definitely give him a follow if you don't. Got some really good videos out there that he does. Uh, definitely iRacing specific. Some pretty cool cars as well he drives. Mainly Mercedes and the like. But, uh, yeah, give him a follow. So 1 minute 35 left. I think sometimes I'm a better under pressure on a lot of these. Your ping's quite bad on this. Minutes ago. I knew on that last race I'd get caught up with them other guys. I knew I would. Nothing I could have done really, I don't think. <laughs> what are you like? After all the slating you gave. <laughs> it's it's alright, mate. Trust me, it, it's good. I mean, I like my Mini, I thrash it around, and this kind of gives me the same feeling as the Mini, so, um, I think it's a good starter series, to, to get you into the mood, so it's cleverly designed, I think. If this is quite a, the, the bank, and that long... that's the end of the session, seventh position. The, the banking, oh, I lost the position there by the looks of it. Uh, and that long straight, you really do feel like underpowered. But around the corners and that, it's quite cool. <laughs> yeah. Assetto Corsi interests me. Um, my um, fiance's just bought a, 
and a Bath 595 Competizione. And that makes me want to play a Seto Corsa and the the the, the, um, the Abarth Assess series they do. But that's a different style of game to this. This is like full on online all the time, isn't it? Yeah, I thought that Nabist. I wasn't sure if I was um, being a bit too cocky thinking that. But yeah, thanks Nabist. It's nice of Dave as well to say that I'm, I seem to know some of the lines. I just go where the speed is really. Right, so we're just waiting for the uh, the red, then the green. And then we've got 10 laps of crazy madness. Currently 7th. Out of... 10 laps. The air 10 is 26 Celsius. Get ready. Keep your nose clean. Green, green, green. Bit of a slide. Right side. Clear right. <coughs> Sorry. Getting frame drop, so I'm being a bit, a little bit cautious. Always off. I don't know, dude. I didn't get you. Let's see if we can get some uh, speed up now. The gap in front is now 0.9. You can see my relative times down below on the right hand corner as well. So that'll give me an idea if I'm pulling away or catching up. Ooh, I thought he was going to hit the barrier then. Walker is now in the lead. Sixth place. Oh no 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 no! Oh. oh, Simon, come on, track limits. Ah, oh, it's pain in the rear, isn't it? The car in front is Garrett. Yeah, we're gonna have to do all that again. Gap to Rivera behind is now 1.3. That's a right pain, that was. I really don't like that corner. But I think I was following that guy too much. I should have followed my own line, not his.
five seconds behind that next place. The track temperature is falling. It's now 42 Celsius. Driver blind, I know. It's so easy to get done, isn't it? It's got to focus. Doing it again, Simon, what are you doing? Run outside track limits, come on, keep it between the lines. It's that one car, as soon as I see it, I get to pot. Alright, Simon, the next car is Rivera. To focus. The guy behind has just done a 121.63. See, it's that blue and white car. I must be colour blind. Oh, he's off. That'll do. That'll do. That'll do. Yellow flag. Watch out. Someone's not happy. Oh, go away, man. Come on, Simon. Good move, mate. Uh, I've got 13, 12 seconds to get uh, the next guy now. Not sure we're going to do it unless there's any accidents. OK, Simon, you're halfway home. Got plenty of fuel. P5. Your lap time was at 125.90. Hi right, Ben, how we doing mate? Really, is that 20? Um, I really don't get them relative times at the minute at the bottom. Yeah, I've had a few issues going on, mate. Behind us now, 1.2. Uh, behind the scenes, so I needed a break for about a week. Um, I have missed you guys, trust me. Uh, it's good to be back. Got a 
guy breathing down my neck from behind. Picked up some time, I don't know where he's got it from. Just watching that one second. Yeah, a bit private. Just loads going on, really. He's reeling me in, that guy. I think my tyres are off. Someone's smoking ahead. Oh, he's catching up that guy behind. Alright Simon, there's a car exit in the pits, heads up. P4, two laps left. Left side. Clear left. That lap time was 124.81. That guy behind, I don't know what happened there. Whether he was just pushing too hard and he clipped me. Alright mate, no worries. Right, Simon, you've got to be a good lad now on this last lap. Sector 1 is 2.1, off the pace. Considering my tyres are badgered. As demonstrated that. <laughs> well, I'm not gaining on anyone, and no one's gaining on me, so I might as well just play it a bit safe. It says I'm fourth. Really?
How did that happen? <laughs> Who knows? That's it. We're done. Right, there's the checkered flag. Great job. You did really well. Apparently I did really well. Oh, guys, that was mental. I've lost my mouse. Here's my mouse. So, I mean, grid position was 7th, I came 4th. I don't have to win, you know. I'm, I'm really not bothered about winning at the moment. If if I've got the opportunity of winning, then brilliant. Looks like there must have been an accident because there's quite a few cars out there. Uh, I might save that, actually. So, where's my screen? You see what points we've got, guys. See where we're at with it. Uh, I won't be doing any more racing from this one. If I didn't think it was going my own way, <laughs> I've just come out of it. I, I can't be fussed with wasting time racing and racing and racing when I'm not going to get anywhere. But I, what I've failed to realise is things can happen in front of you which can get you ahead. So I was last at one point in that race and now suddenly I'm fourth. So if I'd have just bailed at that last point, I would just it would be pants. Obviously, tell me if I'm rambling, guys. I could be talking out of my own. When that D-class then goes to C-class. Yeah, cheers, off key. Thanks, mate. It does, yeah. And you were right, mate. You have to stay, stay positive and stay focused and just keep going on and on and on. Um, let's do a heart rate check. <laughs> No, I didn't get above 143. I'm currently sat at... It's measuring. 104. <laughs> uh. So yeah, I got a, I got a quite a good bump there. So my eye rating's gone up plus 4.1. Um, I think my safety rating's gone up 0.48. So... Yeah, so there's a question mark on my D-class. It's saying, to help keep your license from bouncing up and down when you're near a boundary, license classes and major SR levels overlap a little. Whenever your license changes class, say from D to C, or your SR changes a major level, say from 3 dosh to 2 dosh, the change will include an extra bump of around 0.4 that reflects this overlap. I have no idea what that is saying. I don't know. That means nothing. Actually, guys, let me see if I can... I want to show you what I can see, because I've never really had a chance of... Uh... Getting it to work. Um... On game. <clears throat> Bear with me a second, guys. Um. Is 
it going to load? No, I don't think it's going to load. I was hoping it was going to show the um, event results or series results. Don't think it will let me. Just enjoy the race and be much more rewarding. It is really rewarding, mate. You're absolutely right. Yeah, it, it's really rewarding. It, it's I really want to get that I rated up there so I can um, start driving with the big boys, you know. I think the more, more my confidence will come and the more I start getting into faster cars as well. Um, that'd be quite cool. I wanted to show you what I could see. So if you've never played this game before, or anybody never played this game before, they can give you an, an idea what to look for. Yeah, I don't know what happened at the middle of the pack there, but it really um, helped me out. Like, like, kind of massively. Um, I'm currently, out of all my racing, I am 4,000th out of one, uh, out of 14,525. Matt Malone, <laughs> everyone's heard of Matt Malone, he's second currently on points, but he races way more than me, uh, where I'm in D class, he's in A class. I know a couple of other people as well, but I can't see them in the, in the list. But anyway, I'm probably rambling now. Right, I'm going to give that a rest, guys. Um, I will be back tomorrow. I'm going to do Euro Truck Simulator. I know you guys like me playing that. Um, I enjoy uh, driving the trucks around. I have no idea where I am. I am not going to cheat and figure where I am on that game. I'm going to, I'm going to boot it up live. I'm going to see where I'm at and see what a mess I've made so far. And start building up some miles and start chatting to some people that are interested in that game as well. So, thanks very much for watching. Offkey, thanks for looking after my stream. Um, you do an excellent job in chat there, mate. Thanks for the uh, kind words. Dave Cam, wow. Thanks for coming on, mate, and chatting on my stream. Really means a lot there. Uh, Nabist, good to see you, fella. Hopefully I'll catch you tomorrow on Euro Truck Simulator. Uh, Jack Thomas, Sim Gamer. Uh, gaming 101 and Ben Lawrence so guys thanks for coming on multiplayer um, I haven't spoke to anyone for quite a while about multiplayer so maybe I'll give that a break to maybe Wednesday I might change my slot to Wednesday on multiplayer if you can I mean unless you want to do it together um, I'm not sure bud I'll, um, I'll send you a message over on discord but uh, yeah We'll work something out. But anyway, guys, thanks for watching. And I shall catch you soon. Take care. Bye-bye.